<coughs> Hello, Kirillin Brinkle. I am Xander. I, I don't have a fun little name like Apples the Grey, but I'm just Xander. Um, I was told that you wanted some information about how Eccles came to be. It's kind of a long story. We'll see. Originally, we got this. Her name is Bunny. She's Bunny the Bunny. And she is a Fluffy McFlufferson. Once we got her, he, who was working the camera, kept calling her a Fluffy McFlufferson. And then she, who's right there, yeah, me. <laughs> she... She kept going, he's not, she, she's not a Fluffy McFlufferson, no, she's not a Fluffy McFlufferson, she's a Fluffy McFlufferson. And then they decided, both of them together, that they should get a Fluffy McFlufferson, so to, to, to somehow alleviate this confusion, which it didn't really work. But anyways, so they looked everywhere, they went to the mall, they went to, to stores and and other places, and they couldn't find a Flappy McFlopperson anywhere. But then, one night, he, he was working on, looking on Amazon, and and he found out that, that there's me, only it wasn't actually me, it was some tan bunny that looked kind of like me. And then they both decided, oh my gosh, this is the perfect Flappy McFlopperson! Oh yeah. And then, <laughs> they, uh, they purchased me, and then I was shipped here, and it was very suffocating. I was in this plastic bag, and I couldn't breathe. It was awful. But then, then they opened me up, and I'm like, hi! And then they were like, wow, you're white. And then I'm like, y yeah. And anyway, luckily, they, they don't care what color your fur is. You're always accepted here. And then they were... <laughs> and it was apparently the understanding of him, who was working the camera, that I who am speaking, would would be his bunny, but, but well, that didn't really happen, because I was kind of adopted by her, and then, and, um, I, I like bunny, and so we sleep in the, in the same bed, but not together, because apparently that's icky. Anyways, so then, he, who's working the camera, was all like, well, I want a bunny, so then, he, who's working the camera, went on Amazon, or, or to Google, I don't know, but he looked up the, the brand that's on my butt, see, buddy brand, anyway, it's called Jelly Cat, if you couldn't see, because I was kind of wiggling my butt, because I like to wiggle my butt, wiggle, wiggle, <clears throat> and then he found, he found this other bunny, and he was a gray bunny, and he's like, ooh, I like a gray bunny, so, so then he got a gray bunny, I called Eccles the gray, and he was shipped exactly like me in a suffocating bag, and he was absolutely awful, but then he got here and he was like, oh, there's bunnies everywhere! It's so amazing! It's like the factory where I came from, which I don't remember much about, but there were lots of bunnies there. And he was kind of different than me. He, he's got a big, he's got a bigger belly and, and littler, I don't know, up here, whatever that's called. And, and he doesn't have quite as much beans. Can you hear the beans? Yeah, he doesn't have quite as much of those, but, but he's still awesome. And he was much, much, much more softer and furrier than me. And then, and he was called Eccles the Grey. And um, he, by the way, is a Bottom McBellyson. Or a Belly McBottomson. Belly McBottomson. Anyway, that's his, that's his breed of bunny. Um, and, and that's pretty much the story. That, that's the story of how Eccles the Grey came to be. Oh, Eccles, Eccles, join me. Join me, or just stare creepily at the camera. Oh, hello. Oh, we're picking Eccles up. Anyways, and this is Eccles. See, he's all gray. He's not really talking. Hi. I'm camera shy. Well, you're in front of a camera. You're just not talking to it. Oh, oh I heard the beep for the cookies. We gotta go.